let's really get down to f***ing ground level and let's look at the detail on this because there's some statements that you made there that scare the out of me. We are here in South East London for the Venture Spring event. The Venture Spring event is all about finding a project, a company that will affect a billion people. We're really excited because it really ties up with the ethos of SVK Crypto and having a positive effect. This evening, I'm actually one of the judges on a panel and I can't wait to see the level and quality of companies that come out and what they're trying to solve. I'm all here to help. Yeah, man, you're an impact judge. <laughs> looking to impact the lives of others. And I think the real theme tonight is looking for an idea that's gonna positively impact a billion different people. They're looking for big ideas, big change, and they're looking for something that's gonna work in the long term. I know there's lots of different ideas, lots of UK-based ideas, which we love. And um, I'm really excited to be part of this. I know you're judging. I know you're excited because we've been talking about it all day. Yes. So here we are, and let's go. And then in 2016, uh, I pull up Bitcoin, and I'm like, whoa, what's this? I was like, digital gold, finite supply, peer-to-peer. -peer. I'm like, I like the sound of this. Uh, two years later, uh, we're now uh, one of the largest venture capital firms based here in London. We focus solely on cryptocurrency and blockchain technology. Um, we have a team of eight people. Um, we uh, are all about the community. It's not about writing checks, it doesn't bother me. It's like everybody's got money. And when this goes from the 125 billion, 130 billion market cap it is today, sounds like a lot of money, it's just not, it's tiny. Uh, it goes to 20 trillion, then you're gonna see all the big institutional flows coming in. So uh, it's gonna be a wash of money, but what they don't have is they don't have the power to build communities because in order to have blockchain used, you need adoption. We now host the largest cryptocurrency and blockchain technology meetups each and every month. We have about four to 500 people down every month. Uh, March, March is our next event. Um, we don't have a pitch session, it's never like, trying to sell anything. We bring down thought leaders, good speakers. We started doing meetups two years ago. We then started a podcast uh, called 15 Minutes of Crypto Fame. Uh, we do it not every month, not every week. We do it every day. We've done 320 shows. You know, London always surprises me. Here we are in South East London, and we found what I think is kind of a retro cinema and also a food hall. And it's just wonderful and always gives me the view that London is really the epicenter. It's the epicenter of finance, it's the epicenter of culinary, it's the epicenter of sports, theater, it's the epicenter of blockchain. And that's why we're here tonight. It is, we found a gem, I think is the best way to describe it. <laughs> we didn't know what to expect. We're obviously very excited to be part of this amazing event that Venture Spring is doing and offering. But I really think we found a gem here tonight. And as you can see, I mean, this is an awesome food market. We've got taste from all around the world, which is what blockchain is really representing. Everyone and everyone together, right? Yeah, so I think I, the aspect fits in well. I totally get that. In fact, I've met some people just having some drinks at the bar, uh, some venture capital guys, uh, some guys with some projects, um, guys with that impact, that social impact view, uh, some bankers as well. Um, so I think it's actually setting up to be really interesting. Well, also you've got to remember, like, what's this all about? Well, this is about impacting others, yeah. right? And that's what's really key. And this technology is so powerful and has so many different benefits, right? And this is one of the big benefits it offers. Power to the people, impacting others in a positive way. So I think it's really important that we're starting to see that building out. We're starting to see teams and people thinking along those ways and really putting their energy and thoughts together to make change for others and benefit the greater good of the people. I think uh, when, you, when you benefit change of the individual, you benefit change for all, right? It is a decentralized future. It's a future whereby you can impact and help not just yourself, but everybody involved. And I think uh, this is really great to see Venture Spring bring those type of people together. So uh, really you know, happy to be asked for SVK to be judging and great to have you down here. And uh, let's see how the night unfolds. But uh, yeah, let's do it. Thank you very much, Cassandra, and for Venture Spring for inviting me down here this evening. It's a real honor and a privilege. And thank you all so much for your attendance this evening. My name is Shane Kehoe. I run SVK Crypto. We're a community-driven venture capital firm based here in East London. 
We deploy capital into very early stage projects that will adopt and use blockchain technology. But more importantly, we're community driven because we really believe that to have an impact of a billion people, you have to have the ability to have adoption. We add value at each and every stage for our community because we're passionate at the core about what we do. We realize we're very early days, but we look forward to the next 10 years of development of cryptocurrency and blockchain technology. <laughs> um, my gut feel, um, to be on point and on topic, um, is probably I'm really trying to get to understand exactly the problem it's trying to solve. Um, there, there is numerous other um, examples, and uh, you do have a, a GP. Um, I also agree with what you've said, uh, the validation of what would occur when it goes there. Um, I'd like to know more, um, but I think uh, my gut feel for this is that um, Good in theory, I'd really like to see how it's adopted in practice and how you could actually build that, build that out and do a business. I uh, totally get the problem. Um, it's great that you've got some type of solution at this point in time. Um, I'm a little bit more interested in actually how it works, like the actual underlying tech. So are we looking at weighing scales that are in kitchens? Are they just in kitchens which are taking out the food waste? What happens if something else gets into that weighing scales? Does it, does it you know, move the needle or the weight that it shouldn't be in there? Also looking at different different foods, they weigh different amounts. So a half a melon that's thrown out would weigh a lot less than uh, maybe some caviar or a steak. How does that all work? How do you then break it down into how you categorize the foods? So you gotta help me out here. You gotta let me see, right? I wanna be clear. Let's really get down to ground level and let's look at the detail on this because there's some statements that you made there that scare the shit out of me. Let's talk about details. Right. Revenue. Okay, so what revenues have you got? How can you guarantee that to me? How can you have an IRR right there that says that type of return? Okay, there was definitely some impact on that panel and I'm glad to see that SVK were definitely the instigators. I think we saw four projects in total. Uh, there were some very smart user cases, uh, very big impact projects. All in all, I thought a really well organized event. Uh, I'm glad that we were asked to come down and give our insightful views and we certainly got very much involved in the Q&A. Uh, I'd like to thank Venture Spring. Well, you know, what we saw today was some great impact projects that didn't actually have the adoption of blockchain. So I think that gives us another angle on our own home turf here in London. Uh, we're really dominating finding deal flow. And I think tonight was yet again uh, a real reward for finding companies which uh, in some certain cases have big impact and have big revenues, but don't have a blockchain component. And that's what we're there to do. do you know what? When I was sitting in that room listening to the ideas, all I wanted to do, what I was doing on my phone was reading the ideas that are coming through to us on a daily basis and how fundamental they are to the impacts of the greater, of the greater amount of people in the world. How impactful blockchain really is. How impactful EOS is going to be. Oh man, like I just saw the future. And as you say, the writing is on the wall. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna go back to the office and see the deals that we're looking at. So I think they're gonna be a lot more impactful. I think so. Uh, all in all, thank you very much. Uh, it's been a great night. Thank you for having us on the panel. And I think uh, we'll uh, now see if we can do some further networking and uh, maybe, maybe I might have a beer. Maybe. Maybe. Thank you very much. It's been a wonderful night. That's a wrap.